It takes a lot of work and coordination to get 80 miniature aircraft ready to fly within feet of each other, and the person that makes it all work is Great Lakes Drone Company Director of Operations, Matt Quinn. Matt sees drones as a gateway to aviation. Aviation is fun. I mean, I grew up in Civil Air Patrol, wanted to go in the Air Force. They wouldn't let me fly because of my vision. So then I uh, went into the public safety field, and then uh, from there found a way where I could kind of combine everything and get the aviation aspect going and um, got more into the entertainment aviation aspect. And the process to create an entertaining show starts with the design. It really comes down to what's the story that you want to tell. You know, unlike fireworks, we can actually create shapes, mix it with music, do voiceover, and tell a story. Um, so that's kind of where our focus is, is what kind of story do we want to tell? Great Lakes tells that story using custom-made drones with LED lights. They're about 7,000 lumen apiece, full RGB, full color spectrum, so, you know, if we're making the AOPA logo and it's a specific color, um, we can get the RGB code for that and create that in the show. Once the show design is finalized and Great Lakes is on location, the team checks the frequencies in the area and meticulously pre-flights each drone before placing them in a grid. Once the sun sets and the show is ready to start, Matt and his team do meticulous monitoring of how everything is working. So we're monitoring all the telemetry coming back from each of the drones. We're monitoring for um, any proximity issues. We're also monitoring uh, with our Fordham system. We're monitoring whether or not there's any birds around us, whether or not there's any other drones or aircraft around us. And then we're also monitoring the weather and the winds and all those different things that we have to look at just from like a pilot standpoint. While Matt is busy monitoring the show, the audience is experiencing something amazing. The biggest thing that we want audiences to experience is something new, something different. And everybody has to understand that this is still in its infancy. As technology increases and becomes smaller and more available, everything that we do is only going to get better. The drone shows at AOPA's Flying will be a way to celebrate AOPA's history while using aviation technology of the future. So for the AOPA show, I can't really let the cat out of the bag of some of the stuff that we're doing, um, but it's definitely going to be pilot focused. Um, we're going to represent some of the, the history and the meaning behind AOPA, what AOPA is about, and celebrate their 80th anniversary. Josh Cochran, AOPA Live.